Good evening, Mr. Buffer. Hello again. How did you like today's show? I, I think it went uh, longer than a lot of people expected. Um, Sosnowski has a lot of heart, and uh, this was his first time at a world championship fight. And I think he's, he proved, even though he lost, he proved that he belongs in, uh, in the world class uh, division among the elite heavyweight fighters. Definitely, he's, he's one of the top five heavyweights in the world. Could you give him some chances in the probable re rematch? You know, maybe down the line, but I think what, what a lot of fans would like to see, especially in Poland, would be uh, perhaps uh, Tomas uh, Adamek and uh, Sosnowski in, uh, in a fight. That would be a huge fight for uh, the Polish fans. Yeah, that would be exciting. And uh, how could you... You could put that in a football stadium, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. yeah. Uh, how could you compare uh, Vital Klitschko, the current champion, uh, with the champions uh, in the 70s, for instance, the big big names like Foreman or Muhammad Ali? Well, you know, I, I, would, I will say this about him. He's 38 years old. And if you look at past champions at the age of 38, uh, Lennox Lewis, when he was 37, you know, just managed to pull off a victory over uh, uh, Klitschko and then retired. And I always considered him at that age probably one of the best conditioned fighters at 37. I would have to say now at this point in Klitschko's career at 38, He's a brilliant fighter at 38. Muhammad Ali at age 35, 36 was finished. Show with Joe Lewis, uh, Marciano retired, Larry Holmes, all the great heavyweights of the past, with the exception of George Foreman coming back at, in his 40s. Um, you know, they were all, uh, you know, pretty much finished at that age. So he, he, he stays in great shape and, and between fights, and that's, that's what keeps him in good health. But uh, isn't it a question of the average level of the heavyweight division? Today. Oh yes, yes, yeah, for sure. I mean, uh, there's there's no Muhammad Ali out there right now to, to fight a Klitschko or a, a Mike Tyson or Joe Frazier. So, uh, but that's that's the history of the heavyweight division. You know, the, a great fighter comes along once in a while when there's great competition that that you know gives you a bit of a golden era for six or seven years, and then you have to wait again. So uh, we just have to see what the future holds. Do you do you see some uh, concrete some uh, some big rivals for two brothers for Klitschko's maybe David Hay? Yeah, I, I think the the fans have to see more of David Hay and see what he can do against uh, another quality opponent, and that uh, Hay and against either of the Klitschko brothers would be a, a, a super fight that fans would like to see. Thank you very much. My pleasure.